Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning everybody. Have a nice Friday. Ya, hari ini Jumat tanggal 8 April 2022. Untuk tugas hari ini tugas begini <coughs> yaitu nanti kalian membaca sebuah teks dengan suara yang nyaring ya. Eh uh, tugas ini nanti masuk ke keterampilan untuk K4 ya jadi tolong untuk dilaksanakan kalian baca saja LKS ya yang ini activity activity 23 ya ini activity 23 nanti kalian baca sampai halaman berikut ya ini ya baca kemudian kalian rekam kalian kirim dalam bentuk voice note kirim lewat Jabri WA ya secepatnya kalau bisa hari ini paling lambat besok Gitu ya. Baik, untuk teksnya akan saya beri contoh cara membacanya. Kalian perhatikan baik-baik. Ya, nanti usahakan untuk menyerupai atau mirip cara membacanya. Kalau dulu beda dengan yang sekarang, ya, ya dipakai yang sekarang. Begitu. Oke, mari kita mulai. Let's start now. lost the half of my life. Losing the thing we love was very annoyed. Moreover, it was our belonging. That was I experienced last month. And I felt I lost a half of my life. Seven of my friends with I left for Bogger to finish our project to write a book in this afternoon. We planned to rent a villa to stay the night. It rained heavily when we departed. We went there by cars. Along the journey, we talked about our project and planned to finish it the next day. After about an hour, we arrived in the villa we rent. We were taken by the receptionist to the villa. We rent a villa and two rooms. After taking a shower and having our dinner, we gathered in the main villa to start our project. The captain of our team distributed the job and we had to finish it the next day. After a few hours we worked with our laptop, We started to get tired and sleepy. I got an idea. I played a piano I brought from home while my other friends sang some songs. We were amused with this activity. At about 3 a.m., however, we could stand anymore. Then, we went to bed. Suddenly, I heard one of my friends in the next room came to the villa where I spent the night and woke my friends who slept on the sofa. A few minutes later, I heard a chaos outside the villa. It forced me to get up. I asked my friend what happened and her answer shocked me very much. She said that four of our laptops were gone. I hurried to my room to check my laptop and oh my god. It was not on the table where I put it before slept. I was so powerless. I couldn't think anything but how to replace it. Then, we began to get panic. I saw the captain of our team, accompanied by three of our friend, friends, reported it to the officer and to the police in the police station near the villa. A few hours later, they came back to the villa. One of them said that the police would try to find out of the thieves. We just could hope the best result. My sad and bad experience reminds us to be very careful whenever and wherever we are. I just can hope that will not happen to anyone else. End of question. Close the reader to input your answer. Ya, demikian untuk contoh cara membacanya. Kalian latih dulu ya setelah uh, lancar nanti langsung kalian rekam kirim dalam bentuk voice note hari ini juga. Begitu saya tunggu uh, hasil pekerjaan kalian untuk mengisi nilai K4. That's all for today. Thanks for attention. Good day everybody. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.